Paris Saint-Germain were looking for a confidence-boosting win ahead of the second leg of their Champions League last 16 tie with Bayern Munich when they welcomed Nantes into the Marc de Brands on Saturday evening. It was business as usual for the champions in the early stages. They find themselves 2-0 up within 17 minutes. First, Lionel Messi turned in Nuno Mendes' deflected low cross to open the scoring. His 13th league goal of the campaign. Then the unfortunate Joen Hajam would bundle the ball into his own net after Albon Lafont had stopped a Mendes shot. An awkward one to deal with for the teenager, with Nordi Mukieli waiting behind him to fire into an empty net. But one he won't want to watch back. PSG's confidence had been boosted with an emphatic. 3-0 win over rivals Marseille in the Classique last time out. Canaries have produced an impressive comeback win to beat High Flying Longs in the Coupe de France on Wednesday. With Neymar watching on, injured from the stands. They would battle their way back into this game too. Just after the half hour mark, Ludovic Blas, surprising home keeper Gianluigi Donnarumma. The cross comes shot from the left. Beat the Italian at his near post. Great form during the Classique. Disappointing goal to concede for Donnarumma. The visitors then drew level seven minutes before half time when Ignacius Ganago stole in front of Marquinhos at the near post to head in from a corner. Often a thorn in the Brazilian side, Ganago becomes the second player to score in five different league games against Paris during the Qatari era. Monaco's Wissam Ben Yedda is the other. It's 2 2 at the break. Paris have conceded 15 goals in the league in 2023. Fifth highest tally over the time frame and the highest for a team ranked in the top half. Creating more work for themselves, not for the first time in recent weeks, but also not for the first time in recent weeks they would successfully complete said work. Retaking the lead on the hour mark when Danilo Pereira headed in, killing Mbappe's cross from close range. After his record equaling 200th goal in Rouge Bleu last time out, it looked like Mbappe would have an opportunity to become the club's all-time top scorer when the referee pointed to the spot. Hajam's night getting worse as he brought down Mukieli. But a VAR check confirmed it had in fact occurred outside the box. Of course, a messy free kick can often be almost as dangerous as a penalty, and indeed, it nearly led to a goal. Fired in, just evading Mbappe. Punch clear by Lafont. PSG continued to push for a fourth. Some lovely team play, creating a chance for Messi. And his finish straight at the Nantes keeper. It looked as though Mbappe might have to wait for his record breaking moment. But then, in stoppage time, Collected a Timote Pembele ball in the box with his back to goal, turned and fired into the bottom corner. Win secured and record secured. Number 201. Moving past Eniton Cavani's tally of 200. Kylian Mbappe is now the outright all time top scorer for Paris Saint Germain. 201 goals in 247 games. The age of just 24. PSG remain clear at the summit and can head to Germany in good spirits.